Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Zarif Thakha. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to share the latest IRCC Canadian immigration updates regarding your visa, visit visa, your travels to Canada and all the mandatory requirements regarding um, quarantine and borders. So if you look at my computer screen right now, you would see a page which says that from August 9th, American citizen and PR of US currently residing in and arriving from the US and who qualify for the fully vaccinated travel exemption. These people can travel from August 9. But the most important thing for us, the people who are outside of Canada, is September 7th. Okay. And this is an intended date. Okay. Uh, I mean, if all things go well, and we are praying that all things go well, they would announce that from September 7th, 2021, people living outside of Canada who are not traveling to Canada on an essential travel basis, non-essential travelers, they would be able to come uh, to Canada. As the website says, all other foreign nationals who qualify for the fully vaccinated traveler exemption, they would be able to travel from September 7th, which is an awesome thing. Now, I want to share a tool um, in a few minutes, and that tool will exactly tell you whether you can travel to Canada or not. But before that, you need to check three things okay first of all you need to check your vaccinated travelers exemption then you need to check the requirements checklist and lastly you need to use arrive can uh, this is an app to submit your travel plans and this is a mandatory step now let's go to the tool to find out if you can enter canada which is an amazing tool it is quite easy to use and uh, i'm going to give you an example of how you're going to do it but uh, obviously your uh, scenario in your case could be a little different uh, but i'm taking an example of a foreign national okay uh, including a citizen of us um, it doesn't matter really so uh, your plan to travel to canada is from september 7th or later okay now this is uh, crucial because if your travel is non essential then from september 7th onward hopefully you would be able to travel okay so to qualify as a fully vaccinated traveler in canada have you received a complete series of covid 19 vaccines so this is the series of covid 19 vaccines obviously five uh, covid vaccines are admissible okay and uh, if if you are not vaccinated uh, or if you are only partially vaccinated then uh, you you would select this one but let's take an example of sinopharm or sinovac which are not currently accepted by the government of canada let's take the example of sinopharm or sinovac so how do you plan on entering canada from another country now this page will keep on indicating that uh, you're a foreign national and you're not coming from the us okay so which best describes uh, you or your reason for entry into canada now, if you're an international student, you can check yourself from here. So we're saying uh, the COPR holders. OK, so the COPR holders will check this one who have not yet arrived in Canada, but they are the approved permanent residents of uh, Canada. OK, so uh, based on your answers, you will likely be allowed. Now, likely, basically, uh, this is not a confirmation page. This is not a guarantee page. This is only an informational page for your understanding. However, the final determination will be made by a government official at the port of entry, for example, the airport. So you must be coming to Canada to settle permanently, as I've already made a video that they don't want you to uh, land on a temporary basis, a soft landing, and then go back to your country. They don't want you to do that, and they want you to settle permanently in Canada. So you need to bring a valid COPR document, and you must meet testing and quarantine requirements. So uh, the checklist could be found here. Or if your COPR has expired or is expiring before you can plan your travel, then you would check this one. So this was the tool which you can use if you want to find out whether you're eligible to travel to Canada or not. And we are keeping our fingers crossed that uh, on September 7th, they are basically going to announce that, okay, now non-essential travelers from all countries can travel to Canada. But obviously, uh, the restriction of uh, flights from India is still in place till September 21st. So if you, if you are an Indian resident and you're planning to travel to Canada,
then there are indirect routes which you can follow okay uh, but uh, let's also keep fingers crossed for the september 21st announcement that they are going to lift the ban on uh, indian flights because that is uh, kind of too cautious now keeping in mind with these things uh, what do you think is going to be uh, the impact on uh, the FSW draws or the uh, no program specified draws of express entry. Do let me know in the comment sections below. And if you have not already subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing. This is Ali Thakar wishing you guys all the best.